Hello YouTube, this is Chantal and today I'm doing a tutorial. It's a sew-in. I know I look crazy, but this is my braid pattern. And I'm going to be using a net. And the hair that I'm using is the chocolate hair. And this is the 100% human hair, chocolate yakky weave, and a 12 and a 14 inch. I purchased this hair with my own money. They did not send it to me. I'm going to come back with uh, the final results. <laughs> YouTube. So I'm going to show you how I sew the track onto the net. And I don't um, go through the net until I'm at the end. I just wrap it around like so. And then I take the, the thread and loop it in there and pull it tight. And I wrap it around the track. Loop it in itself and pull it tight, and that's it. And then when I get to the ends, I'll tack it into the um, track and secure it that way. But other than that, I don't do that. So I'll come back with the finished product. This is Chantal, and I'm coming with the finished product of the chocolate hair sew-in tutorial that I was doing. Um, I've had this hair in for about two days now, and um, it's it's good hair for the for the price that you pay. Um, I have a 14 and a 12 inch and I believe the 12 inch was like $24 and the 14 inch was $29. Um, the hair does shed. I've had it in for like I said about two days. The hair does shed. Um, every time I run my fingers through it it's coming out. So I don't know how long this will last. This is my first time using the hair. Um, it holds a curl really well. I curled it a few hours ago, I'm here at work in the back office, and I curled it a few hours ago, and I didn't put any hairspray or anything in it, and it held the curl. It's holding the curl really well. Um, I'm just going to show you the back because I did cut layers in it just with the razor. I just took it and ch -ch -ch right on down. Really simple. I hope you can see that. So that is the back and the, the, the curls and the layering, and it, it has... It has lots of body, it has lots of bounce, um, very silky, very soft, blends really well with my hair. I have it in a one um, because I do get my hair rinsed uh, black because I have grays at a young age. But anyway, so um, I hope you guys learned something from the videos and I'm still working on how to make one video so that it's not so many sections. But I thank you so much for all of my new subscribers. I have 16 now. Um, and I just look, I'm looking forward to doing what you guys need me to do. If you have any questions, please feel free to, um, comment, rate, and subscribe. Inbox me if you want to know anything, and I'll be sure to help you out as much as I can. Um, today's look is from the, uh, Smashbox Wish Palette, and it's the green column. Um, I hope you can see that. If you want me to do a tutorial on that, uh, let me know. Um, down below. Um, thanks. Bye bye. Hello YouTube. This is Chantal and today I'm doing a tutorial. It's a sew-in. I know I look crazy but this is my braid pattern. And I'm going to be using a net. And the hair that I'm using is the chocolate hair. And this is the 100% human hair chocolate yakky weave in a 12 and a 14 inch. I purchased this hair with my own money. They did not send it to me. I'm going to come back with uh, the final results. Let's go. <laughs> YouTube. So I'm going to show you how I sew the track onto the net. And I don't um, go through the net until I'm at the end. I just wrap it around like so. And then I take the, the thread and loop it in there and pull it tight. And I wrap it around the track, loop it in itself, and pull it tight. And that's it. And then when I get to the ends, I'll tack it into the um, track and secure it that way. But other than that, I don't do that. So I'll come back with the finished product. Thanks. Hi, YouTube. This is Chantal, and I'm coming with the finished product of the chocolate hair sew-in tutorial that I was doing Um I've had this hair in for about two days now, and um, it's it's good hair for the for the price that you pay. Um, I have a 14 and a 12 inch, 
and I believe the 12 inch was like $24 and the 14 inch was $29. Um, the hair does shed. I've had it in for, like I said, about two days. The hair does shed. Um, every time I run my fingers through it, it's coming out. So I don't know how long this will last. This is my first time using the hair. Um, it holds a curl really well. I curled it a few hours ago. I'm here at work in the back office and I curled it a few hours ago and I didn't put any hairspray or anything in it and it held the curl. It's holding the curl really well. Um, I'm just going to show you the back because I did cut layers in it just with the razor. I just took it and right on down. Really simple. I hope you can see that. So that is the back and the, the, the curls and the layering. and it, it has it has lots of body. It has lots of bounce. Um, very silky, very soft. Blends really well with my hair. I have it in a one um, because I do get my hair rinsed uh, black because I have grays at a young age but anyway so um i hope you guys learned something from the videos and i'm still working on how to make one video so that it's not so many sections but i thank you so much for all of my new subscribers i have 16 now um and i just look i'm looking forward to doing what you guys need me to do if you have any questions please feel free to um, comment rate and subscribe inbox me if you want to know anything and i'll be sure to help you out as much as I can. Um, today's look is from the uh, Smashbox Wish palette and it's the green column. Um, I hope you can see that. If you want me to do a tutorial on that, uh, let me know um, down below. Um, thanks. Bye-bye. Hey YouTube, so this is Chantal again <laughs> and I'm coming to do a final review of this chocolate hair. Um, this is the same hair I installed a couple of weeks ago around Christmas time. And uh, my final review on this hair is that it's crap. Crapola. Um, the good part of it is that the texture blends with my hair very well. The bad part of it is that it sheds like crazy. I don't know if you guys can see this. I'm going to try to get some out for you because it really takes no effort. Look at that. Can you see that? I hope you can. I mean, that's just with me doing like this. Look at that. This is freaking ridiculous. And... Um, Scratch that is good enough for the money I paid because altogether that was like 60 some dollars that I paid for this hair. So to try to make it look stylish, I braided it up, put some mousse on it. Thought I was going to wear it curly for the day at work. This is the back. Oh, that's that piece of This is the back. Y'all, when I got to work and wore it like that, the hair was like, like I was a werewolf. It was like swelling up on me. So then I'm like, okay, what can I do to it? So I just braided it and put it in like a loose ponytail to the side. But look, it's still coming out. Do y'all see? I hope you can see this because I know my camera jacked. Y'all pray for me to get a new camera. But I will never. Look at that. Look at that. Never purchase this hair again. And I'm not one to down the company, you know. But I'm one to be honest. And I don't want you guys going out buying this. And it's shedding like this. I thought I was going to be able to keep this in until like the end of the middle of January. I'm ready to take this out now. And it's only been two weeks. Look at that. So that's my final take on the chocolate brand hair by Evertrust. Again, I say the good part is that the texture blends very well. Can't see where my hair stops and it ends. And I guess, you know, they say it's Remy-like. So, I've never had Remy hair, but I hope that when I get it, it matches my texture. That's the only benefit I see in having this hair is that, okay, once it once I get the Remy, I can see that it'll match my texture or whatever. But look at that. It's just coming out. Just coming out. Just coming out. So, um, this is the green look again. I'm really feeling that. Trying to enhance it. I think I'm going to deepen it some more. 
if you guys want to see a tutorial on that please leave the information below in the comment section send me an inbox of looks that you want me to do um, any questions that you have I have another sew-in tutorial coming up um, I did my sister's hair and you'll be able to see that and the finished product you're really only going to see the base and then the finished product so she used the ultra micro yakky hair and um, that one is doing better than this and it was only $19 a pack so but anyway um, Hopefully, I'll be coming back with a makeup tutorial really, really soon. And uh, again, thank you guys for watching. Thank you to all of my new subscribers. And uh, see you next time.